What's going on guys? My name is Glorious Mischief and welcome back to another episode of Elden Ring. Today I am going to do a couple of subquests, but really I'm going to try to advance the main quest. And the first thing that I want to do is I want to go and talk to this guy because he lets you know about something specifically. The howl of a wolf. Mhm. I suppose he must still. I know. Next time you hear the wolf's howl, make don't fret. I just have an inkling. Yeah, so we need the finger snap. Goodbye. And the finger snap is going to be what gets us to a very friendly boy, um, which he's right over here. Uh, there he is. That's where we're going. Let's go here and go there. And uh, yeah, there's a couple things to do uh, right away. Um, I guess we can meet Kenneth, too, because he's right here. And then... Um, there's a big friend that we've got to meet, too, who is one of my favorite characters in the whole game. Um, but first things first, we've got to meet uh, probably, well, I mean, I would say one of the coolest character models in the game. And you can get his armor later on if you follow the quest line, which we will be following. Um, but Blythe is just awesome. He's such a cool character. I love him. Don't do it. Let me snatch your runes. Don't chase me, friend. Wee 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 woo. All right, so he's right up there, by the way. Oh, don't are they still following me? No. He's right there. See him? So let's jump off of Torrent and over here, and then we'll meet our friend. Let's get our snaps out. Snaps. Whoops. Switch with... Where's finger snap? Finger snap. There it is. Um. Ready? There he is. It's Blythe. Can we talk to the bay? Who goes there? Carly sent you, did he? Never the bloody busybody. Hmm. The name's Blythe. Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrow. Apparently an Irish name, Blythe? Because it looks like Blade, but it's Blythe. Also, I've heard. Come tell me if you find him before I do. So he wants us to go and fight a dude at an Evergale, or an Everjail. Um, and he is going to be one of the summons there. And that Everjail, if you're curious, is just right there. It's really close. It's so easy to do. Uh, so... Let's head over there and do it real quick. Um, yeah, he doesn't like the dude there. <laughs> and he's been chasing him down. Uh, but basically, he wants you to summon him so that you can go in there and just, uh, you know, and tap him up for Blythe. But Blythe is coming with you. Um, yeah, it'll be fun to do. Come on, baby. We're going to dip through. Whee! Also, I'm going to try to do less cuts because I was told by a couple of people that they just want to see the gameplay. So, less cuts. Which is fine with me. It makes it easier in my life, honestly. I was just trying to give a really quick experience of the game. And I really want to get through this game because, man, I can't wait for the DLC. I'm so excited to DLC it up. Whee! There we go. That's the average jail right there. So we're going to jump on in here. And this time, when we get in, you're going to notice there's going to be a summon right in there. Pretty sure it's right when we get in. Let's double check because, yeah, there's that. There it is. So this is Blythe. Yeah. It also makes this fight way easier because this guy is really sneaky. Come on. Come on, Blythe. Look at all the blood stains. <laughs> Rotting in a cell is no true justice. All right, ready? No. Blade. This is where it ends for you. Woo! Oh yeah, we doing some stuff. Oh, we got him. Dip, dip. Look how easy this is with Blythe. Woo! Got him. I got hit a little bit at the end, but... Ooh, the Bloodhound Fang. Bloodhound Fang is really, really good. 
by the way. Um, it's just a little bit bigger of a weapon, and I don't like to use it because I like to be a big faced boy. I like to be faced. And uh, the Bloodhound uh, Tooth is just not great. But um, the Bloodhound Step is awesome. A lot of people run that. It's fine. Um, I don't know, as far as, you know, abilities to use, it lets you be real slippery, it lets you run really fast, so it's nice, but it's not a must-have for me. Especially with the build I'm going to be doing, but I don't know. A lot of people like the Bloodhound Step. And look, Blight is here now. Oh, let's go talk to you, Blight. Tell me a little bit about what you need then, bud. Ah, right. There you are. Hard to work for it, but it's done. Don't say I'm not a man of my word. Somber smithing stones too. Really not great. Oh yes. If you venture north to Rio Lucaria and come across a venerable <laughs> blacksmith, tell him I sent you. I will. Sure to treat you. I owe you one, I reckon. And we are gonna go to Rio Lucaria. Or <laughs> sorry, we are going there. Um, so that'll be fun. Uh, so also the churches here are kind of clutch, and I want to go there because down in there is a really sweet katana. Uh, it's the Moon Veil Katana, and I do like that one quite a bit. Um, but next, we want to go here because we want to go talk to Alexander because I love him, and he's adorable. And if you don't like Alexander, uh, you hate on the just and the kind. Because <laughs> Alexander's awesome. Also, I kind of want to go and kill Pumpkinhead because Pumpkinheads are just fun to kill. I love them. They're also not that hard, and they generally give you a couple souls. Oh! <laughs> I say as I get bopped right away. Well, he's in the bops. Okay, well, that was easy. Sanctuary stones from you. Alright, well... <laughs> I talked up Pumpkinhead, and uh, he really wasn't hard at all. Let's go up here, because he's right up there. Yeah, you hear him? <laughs> also, I did a couple things off camera, but not much. I just did a little bit of exploring. Look at there he is. Hello, sir. Oh, my stars. I'm so happy to see you. And I you, friend. I am Alexander, also known as the Iron Fist. And as you can see, I'm stuck here. Please. <laughs> yeah, I'll help my you out, buddy. Thanks. Just give me a good smack from the rear, and I'll pop <laughs> clean out. Don't dally. Give it your <laughs> It doesn't have to be something big. It just has to be a couple whacks. Pretty sure it's just a damage threshold. There he goes. Triumphant delight. Look how cute he is. Oh, Alexander. Ah. Well played, good sir. <laughs> well played. Mighty wallop of yours almost spelled the end of me. Isn't he so cute? <laughs> oh. Well, I thank you. And oh, give it to me. My appreciation. It's gonna be a little, yeah, exalted flesh. All right, all right. Again, pleasure is mine. I journey to the east, where and beyond these lands lie the city upon this, mm. which is Redmain Castle. The Festival of Redon. I'd heard whispers of such festivities before. Doesn't the notion set you? <laughs> it does. I am quite excited then, Alexander. Quite excited. Hello, look, it's a dog. <laughs> I don't know why, but the Elden Ring community likes to call the turtles dogs. So they're dogs. We live with the dogs. Ooh! A snatch? We gonna run through. We gonna run, baby. Hello, castle. Oh, there is one thing that I did get. Um, I got half of the uh, Daedalus medal because I was just walking around over there. Ooh, friend. Have I gotten this one already? I have gotten this one because um, I was just walking around and I forgot that the Daedalus medal was in this one spot. But you need it to get to a certain part of Nokrom, and um, which is a city underground. Uh, so yeah, I figured, hey, might as well. Don't you run from me. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Come here. Come on, buddy. The Tibia Mariner. Uh, you need to fight the Tibia Mariners to get the the love and ad adoration of one of the uh, PCs of the game. Don't do it. 
I forgot that they can hurt each other. Nope, don't do it. Don't do it. Gibia. Oh, he's splashing. Oh, he be splashing. <laughs> oh. Yeah, get your friends. Watch out, he's riding the wave. Hey, don't. Don't do it. There's my bike. Come here, bye. Um, also, another note that I got was that people didn't want me to do summons as much. So I'm going to do less summons unless I need them. Oh, there's a friend back there. I think I can get him. Ooh, come here. Gotcha. And then those guys fade away. But he gives you a death root, which you can feed to Garank. Ooh, ashes too. And Garank, uh, you know, it's kind of a weird subquest because Garank's not super cool most of the time. Uh, and eventually he kind of tries to kill you. But you know, you live and you learn with Garank. Also, I know that at times when I'm fighting bosses, I get a little quiet. But you'll have to forgive me because, man, sometimes it takes focus. And I'm trying to be quick about it while also allowing for enough challenge in there. Because I don't want to just cheese it. Because really, there is a summon in the game that is by far the best, right? We all know it. It's the Mimic. Um, or the tier. <clears throat> and instead of using FP to bring the summon in, you just use a little bit of health. But it's basically a Mimic of yourself. Um, and to beat it quickly... Ooh, do I have one of the keys? Oh, no, I do not want to attack a turtle. Um, to beat it, all you have to do to cheese it is you go in there with no weapons and no armor equipped, and it has the same thing, and you basically can never take damage from it, and then you can put your stuff back on, and you're good to go. But it also... Oh, turtles! Hi, turtles! Are they gonna say dogs? Dog. <laughs> Dog. Time for death. Dog. These guys are just friends. Um, yeah, the Mimic tier, it's great. I don't know if I'm going to get it this playthrough just because it feels so cheesy, but it is just good to have. I got a turtle talisman. Yay, the turtles. <clears throat> but yeah, I don't know. I feel like as far as um, gameplay goes with the summons, I'm not opposed to them. I feel like the game put them there for a reason, you know? It's not necessarily an easy game to play, so if you need some summons, summon away. Um, and I like to play with summons because I feel like it uh, distracts the boss enough for you to heal because some bosses are really frantic. <clears throat> but if you're not dealing with that issue, then I don't know. Who cares about the summons? <laughs> Is that another church? Have I been to this church? The, uh, the, the place I'm going is down there. Hello, friend. Past that guy. But I'm going to go to this church. I can't remember if this is Blood Church? Because we're going into Kaled area. Oh, yeah. So there's a boss in here, or there's a big enemy. Um, Kaled is uh, one of the more disliked areas. <laughs> okay. I'm going to turn this on. And let's dance. There he is. I'm fast. Ooh, but he whacks. I heal. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. We dodge. And we heal. That's the bar that's the nice part about um dealing with like light weapons, is that you can move out of your animation so quickly. Which in this game is kinda clutch. Come on. Ooh, he's trying. I feel like um this game or these these games have always had this kind of like butcher blade in him and they love the butcher blade and it's always got that animation Ooh, we coming down to it tell me your baby oh she be jumping gotcha sorry anastasia yeah but caleb as i was saying is like the most unloved area in this game uh because it's got the t-rex dogs to be fair t-rex dogs are a pain in the butt uh, and it's a pretty solid, like, difficulty spike compared to the rest of the game, early game. Um, but, you know, difficulty spikes are what this game is all about. <laughs> really, though. 
I'm gonna get some more endurance. So the time I continue to swap my sword more efficiently, yes. So I've decided that I want to try a build that I've never really done before that I want to give a shot to. Well, I took you so to let's build it together, shall we? Uh, Ash of War Duplication, I want to Ash of War Bloody Slash Duplicate. Yes, perfect. Uh, so then I want to put both of them with the blood. Yeah, on that one. And then I want this one on there as well with the blood. Heck yeah! Uh, so then, do I, I need to just build a, burn a little bit of resources. Let's do two of those. Um, now, we've got blood scimitars. Yes, already. which are no, awesome. Um, so let's strengthen our swords. Can I not? Oh, I need more. Alright, whatever. I'll do it. I'll do it. I just need to go get some of that stuff. Some of that sweet, sweet stuff. Um, but I can do that at the tunnel, right? If I go down here, I can do that. So let's go there. See if I can go grab some upgrade stuff. Because if I can upgrade those, whoo, baby, those are going to be so sweet. Um, I've never run Blood Scimitars early game. But I get the feeling like it's going to be awesome. Because I usually try to just, I don't know, I've done a lot of strength builds. I like decks in Dark Souls 3. I like to run the Lothric Knight Swords. Um, so don't judge me for that because it's one of my favorite builds of any game. And I know that everyone likes to do the big weapons in that one, but come on. The last Lothric Knight Swords are so sweet. Um, yeah. So let's go ahead and, I already put that on there. Where is it? There it is. Let's go in there. See if we can grab what we need to grab. Because there's a lot of cool stuff down there, actually. Can I sneak down, or do I need to die? Alright, I can get in there. Perfect. Sweet! There's a giant dragon there. Which, uh, he's hilarious. And, uh, yeah, he just really... He's really just a good time, that dragon. And... Jump. Ooh. Ooh, I didn't die. Love that. Hi, friends. Hello. But basically, now my swords all do bleed proc, which is awesome. And although most of the stuff in these areas don't bleed... Uh, ooh, is there a little hidden spots? Yes, there is. I'm gonna do that. Um, leap! Sweet! There's always little hidden spots in the mines that if you go to, and it's worth doing because a lot of times there's little items in here, and let's see what's down here. Yeah. Golden Rune 4. Already worthwhile. Um, but yeah, all my stuff does bleed now. So now my, my job is to attack frantically and often. So my little dodge in, dodge out technique, it's not going to work as well anymore. But that's fine. Let's do this. Perfect. And then let's start upgrading our stuff real quick. Gotcha. Ooh. Sweet. Hi, dog. Booty. <laughs> Ooh, I've got no healing. That's not great. It's not great at all, but we can sneak over here. I've got no FP. We're just living the dream, baby. What's in here? Is he... Oh, it's just one of these guys. All right. I say that, and I know that he'll probably kick my butt because I've got no healing. got the slam. Let's give him some blood. Oh man, that does so much. Oh, he done got me. To be fair, I had no healing. I was just blind by the seat of my pants. Basically, once I go in there now, I should have no problem. Beating Ooh, steak. I love a good steak of America. So this is our first time experiencing these. The steaks, they um allow you to just respawn right next to the boss, which is awesome. Ah. 
Well, let's shake of America at up and go and kick this by right in the tuchus. But now that we've got our blood stuff, ooh, whoops, they go the wrong way. Oh, oh, it's down there, right? The stake is here. So interesting. Oh, okay. Well, let's just run through because I don't need to deal with any of y'all. Whee! Except that I kind of need to wait for this, which is a little bit suboptimal. If I'm being entirely honest. Ouch. I'm okay. Whee! Follow me if you will, friend. <laughs> I was hoping he was going to come down. Alright, perfect. He did! <laughs> he followed me! Oh, did you drop something nice? Hey, Smith and Stone. Not complaining about that one bit. Alright, we runs in. Wee -dee 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 -dee. Hey, what's up, friend? Have some blood. Oh, I missed him with my blood. Don't do it. Oh, don't do it. Let me get my runes. Let's heal. Let's prepare to do battle with the boy. Oh, he attacked. Take it. Really should have healed, but I'm alive still. Against all odds. Nope. Nope. Whoops. Ooh. Oh, he's slamming. Oh, he's slamming. Oh, he's hitting me with the slam witch. Ooh. Oh, he keep on slamming. Let's heal up one more time and hit him with some blood, and we did. Oh, I missed him. There we go. Bye, friend. A roar medallion. What does it do, and how terrible is it? Let's see. Roar. Enhanced roar and breath attacks. I don't do any of that. <laughs> Let's go deal with a dragon. This boy has been just sitting here all game. And if you want to, you can just go straight over here and fight him. But he's a little difficult. Ag heal. So... Give him a smacking around. Come on, baby. Woo! I don't really like him very much, and he's a pain in the butt. Dodge. Woo! Oh, come on. Aggies. Have some bleed. Ooh, that's rude, Aggies. Yeah, there he goes. There he goes. Okay, we're gonna try to run at him from diagonals. We don't get fired. Oh, he killed a friend. Appreciate that, bud. Okay, keep running. Ready? Here he comes. And dodge. He does a couple flaps, and then you just dodge out of the way the flaps. Ooh, the bleed. Dang, that bleed is huge. No thanks. <laughs> oh, he got me. No thank you. Don't walk, don't flap away, buddy. Woo! Oh, we go this way. You gotta go to the left of them. Perfecto. Let's get a little heal in. Because why not? You gonna drop your flags? Nope. Oh, I missed. Don't do it. Oh, he done hit me. Pardon me, Ag Heal. Are you gonna do your flaps again? Oh, no, you're just getting some distance. I don't really like that you do that. Running, running, running. Ooh, rock. That rock almost had me. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, come on. We're close to Aggie. Woo! In the face. No, thank you. And let's just do that for fun. Oh, we missed him. Got him. Sweet. Great enemy fell. How many souls do you give me? 5k. And I get a dragon heart. Uh, that is really worth it. Also, once you beat him, see that little arc over there? You get to go over there and have a little friendly chit chat with a friend. Pretty sure that there's... Is there anything in here worth doing? I forget this little ruin. I need to stop being so distracted. Let's stop being distracted. Yeah, there's something down there. Well, we can be distracted for a sec. Come on. Going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Zooming through the sky. Dogs. Dogs. I just beat a dragon. Don't make the dogs kill me. Although that really sounds par for the course of this game. Reds. Are the dogs still behind me? <laughs> Don't do it, rat. Rat! Don't! Oh, there was a bonus rat. We dodged. I'm telling you, even the most simple enemies in these games are huge problems. <laughs> healed as much as I healed against the dragon. <laughs> Arc oh, rune arc down here? Dang! Those things empower the uh, greater runes that you get from defeating the main bosses of the game. And they are clutch. Oh, it's a teleporter. Let's see where it takes me. See, this is why you don't go distracting yourself. You get sent into the netherworld. <laughs> oh, to the crystal tunnel? That's not... That's not bad. Except for the fact that there's a lot of enemies in here who are very strong. Much that. Oh, that's right. I forgot about those guys. I'm pretty sure that the stuff in here... Oh, yeah. It's way too high level for me. Oh, no. But I had so many souls. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. Well, whatever. Oh. Whoa. Oh, there's so many of them. Ooh, we're dodging and we're diving. I'll grab him. Okay, heals. And we out. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. All right. Ooh, side of grace. Side of grace. Clutch side of grace. I don't even know where it put me. Where am I? Oh, I'm just right there. That's really not that far away from all the stuff I've been doing. Eh. Fine. Thank you. I definitely don't want to be here. Ooh. That's fun. That's very fun. Alright. I need to stop being distracted. As I said before, I'm a very distractible man. Is there? Yes. Let's grab that side of Grayson. And deep. And uh, deep. Ooh, a dog. I got the dog. Alright. Let's go, baby. Yeah, so this is where we beat Margit, if you recall. So, we're gonna go in here, and there's a dude, there is a boy. There's a boy in here that we don't like. We're going to deal with him. <laughs> I think that you have two choices. You can either go in through here and run by everyone, or you can go around. Either way is fine. 
Come over here, would oh, you? I'm coming over. I it's tightly guarded. Oh, <laughs> the guards don't you breach the Uh sure. Yeah, your I pray. So this boy, he might seem like, oh, he's just a dude. No. He is a jerk. And if you don't kill him, he's gonna take all your stuff. Not even joking. He'll take all your runes. Uh, he, like, robs you as you go through. He's a jerk. But he's got the bell, glass shard, and a silver pickle towel. But if you don't kill him, though, uh, when you beat Godric, he's there. And he's kicking him, which is funny. Um, so that's, you know, just a hoot. But, um, yeah, he's, he's a jerk and steals your stuff. So I really don't want to deal with him. I'll take his tip, and I'll be out of here. Um, but... What was I gonna... Oh, the birds. The birds are wild. Just be prepared. When they come down, they're gonna be burdened. They burden up a storm. There he is. Oh. Nope. <laughs> That was hilarious. I told you, the camera really isn't your friend because when I was focusing on him, I was running towards him and nope, wasn't gonna help me out. <sighs> Thanks. Thanks for the cliff roll there, bud. I'll take that. But yeah, Godric the Grafted, he's a really fun fight. So I'm excited to do that one. Um, yeah, let me get my runes back. Oh, these guys, the horn tutors. Ready for the horns? Because he. Yep. He welcomes all his friends. Oh. Not easy to fight these guys on here, mind you. Don't recommend it. But you gotta do what you gotta do, baby. An exile hood. Delightful. Um, also in this game, armor is like a little bit more of a thing than it was in previous FromSoft games. Really not much. You can wear the same armor most of the game. It's not going to do a whole lot. Hello. The bleeds. I love the bleeds. Ooh. I love to roll. Uh, also, just so you know, they love to blow stuff up on you. Watch. Yeah, when you see those bar barrels, just don't. Just don't. Not worth it. And you? Gotcha. But if you roll through them, apparently the oil that's in them is no longer flammable. <laughs> it's all good once you roll through them. Oh yeah, this is a hilarious one. The first time I did this, uh, I was terrified. Because you go in here, and you're like, hmm, interesting. I wonder what's in here. And then you hear a knife, and there he is. There's the bite. He's a problem, by the way. Butt stab? But stab. Let's heal. And then let's deal with the rest of them. Oh, I was gonna butt stab. Let me butt stab. Nope. Rude. Yeah, see, he's a problem. I'm telling you. Because he's pretty merciless once he gets going. Come on, bud. Nope. Nope. Hey. 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 <laughs> he got me. I was talking so much trash on him, too. <sighs> what a rude boy. Well, we'll go through there. There he is. Nope. 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 
No. Heals. Oh yeah. Much that. You know what we're gonna do? Nope. Woo! I forget about the bleed slash. That thing is so weak. Alright, we got him. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Ooh, the curved sword talisman. I think that's pretty good for my build, isn't it? Am I tripping out? Uh, no. It's not. Well, that's fine. <laughs> Back in the um, beginning of the Dark Souls 3 days, um, the Karthus Curve Swords were like the thing to be playing. And uh, you could put a little bit of rouge on them and ooh, that bleed build was nice. Um, but yeah, I don't really run a lot of bleed builds in Dark Souls 3. Um, or 2. <laughs> or any of the Dark Souls games, really. Just this guy. Um, but it is fun. I will say, it is fun. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> it is fun to do these builds. Someone fell. <laughs> it's so funny to see these those moments when the, the NPCs just decide that they're done with this, this life, man. They're on to the next thing. Just getting some free runes for no good reason. Alright, up the ladder. We go ups the ladder. Ups the ladder. Oh, look at him! That is classic from soft. If you don't like jump scares, these games are not for you. Is there a bonus? No, I was like, is that another friend? Hmm. Hmm, friend. Do -do 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 up the stairs. I know for a fact there's going to be more jump scares to be had. Ooh. So these guys are difficult. But I don't really need to deal with them right now. Because I don't need any business with them. Is there... This is a short one, right? But I don't have access to it. That's right. Ooh, there's the grace. That's exactly what I need, though. Grace. <laughs> Made it. All right, let's rest here. Do I have enough for a level? 4,300? That's a good chunk. Ooh, I don't. But I think I can burn one of these guys and I'll have enough. Let's see. No. <laughs> I don't. But I think if I use all these guys, then I should have enough. It's nice to also like clear those out of your inventory every once in a while because I feel like they stack up forever. And I never remember. And that's on me. Ooh, endurance? I'm gonna do a little bit of that. Little vigs. I'd like to get vigor and endurance up to 20. And then from there, I can start going crazy. Ooh, the blood hawks. These boys are very rude. Yep, they do that to you. Nope. Oh. Rude. Take it, Bloodhawk. Yeah, the two of them is a lot to deal with. One is a lot. Oh! <laughs> well, I didn't have to worry about it. They took care of the problem themselves. <laughs> that never happens. The first time I dealt with them, I was like, okay, so this is just the problem of the game right here, right? The Hawks. Because they are rude. Those things are fast, and they blow stuff up at you all the time. Let's go down. Let us explore. Ooh, nuggets. Ooh, some golden runes. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm gonna try jumping, but I'm gonna just... Bip, 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 bip. Oh! Okay, cool. I took no damage. <gasps> Ooh. There is a friend in here. Hey, bud. Ah, the pleasure's mine. Roger. Roger is the name. A sorcerer. I'm looking for a little something when I'm not hot footing it from the mm. troops. But enough about me. What this place is bristling with tarnished hunters, you know. They sacrifice our kind. Not exactly. Gross. The place I'd stroll into without. A... Near to kill Godric. 
here to challenge Godric and let you can see it then. I take well. Enjoy <laughs> tarnished, but unlike you, I've seen neither hide nor hair of this guidance for the long still. Mm, bummer. I won't forget how it felt when I first I'm privy to a few Would you care to learn one? As a fellow tarnished. I don't really think I need any of his stuff. No. I don't. Those are awesome though. Um what were you looking at? Will you tell me about it? No. He's looking for something. Uh, but basically, we're getting closer to Godric, which I'm excited about. Is there a Sight of Grace in here? I can't remember if there's a Sight of Grace down here. Whoops. And we And we But there is a big boy down here. I know that. And he's not fun to deal with. He's basically the, uh, the knight I dealt with in the area up above. And then he's got a friend, too. Which is super not nice. Super not nice. Nope. Nope. We're gonna heal. Let's do the dance, baby. Nope. Oh, I thought I had him with the butt stab. Come on. Let me get your butt. Let me get to it. Ooh. There's the butt. That's what I'm looking for. And then have some of this. And have some more of that. That is really good. Sweet. We made it. <sighs> I, I actually like this build. I have not run a build like that ever. That's really fun. Uh, I didn't need to go up here. So I won't. Ooh. But I'm really excited to be Godric. I want to be Godric. Okay, thank you. I just want to go down. I don't want to see you fall to your death. Oh, he's fallen. <laughs> that guy fell off, legit. You fell off, man. <laughs> Ooh, secret door, mayhaps? Not too much. A uh, much too much. All right, cool. A little golden rune action. And sneaks over here. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. So there's another grafted scion down there. The first thing we fought in the game. Right there. You can fight him. You don't need to. But you can fight him. Hello, friend. I'm going to go collect your stuff without you paying attention to me. Snatch it. A mimic's veil. Hmm. Alright, cool. Hey, buddy. How y'all doing? Sorry, I've fallen. <laughs> hey. Who's throwing stuff at me? Don't throw stuff. Gotcha. Sorry, I was just looking at exalted flesh the whole time. So he is a little difficult to beat, that grafted scion, but he's over there, so I'm not going to mess with his skis right now because I need to get to Side of Grace. And I just really want to beat Godric. I'm trying to get straight to that boy because I'm feeling pretty prepared for him. What is, what is in here? I, I'm so distractible in this game. Oh, hey! <laughs> Oh, hey there, friend. <laughs> uh. All right, let's go. So up here, this area, full of enemies, right? So you dip, because if you get through over here, there's a little safety safe. Little safe nook in here. Oh, there's a lot more things than I want. Oh, dog. Whoops. Whoops. Thank you, bud. I went to the wrong safe spot, by the way. As you can tell, probably. <laughs> the safe spot is up here. It's up here. There we go. That's exactly what I was looking for. 
Oh, puppy dog. Oh, thanks, puppy dog. You're not welcome, pup. Ooh. We're getting deeper in the castle. Yeah. You know what I for totally I forgot to do? Wondrous physic needs to go on there. Yeah, baby. Wait a second. You need to go there. Yeah, there we go. Now, if I want to, I just pop that there. Um, it's not that helpful for me right now, but it would be good for just random boss stuff, I guess. Pull the lever. I believe this is just a shortcut. What? Not gonna wait for it. We're going places. Oh, it's not a shortcut. <laughs> I gotta sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I hear the dinglings. I hear them. Mm. Oh, the little pots. Oh, look at them all. Little pots. I don't want to fight you, Pots, because I love Alexander. I just love him. <laughs> Look at him all. Just potting around. Ugh. Just delightful. Alexander is, like, the best. So, um, in Dark Souls 3, uh, there's a character named Solaire, who everyone knows as, like, the sun bro, and he's the best. Ooh, I should get that. Um, but there is no Solaire in this game. So I feel like they felt the need to like compensate for like the fun dude. Um, because they don't have Solaire and they also don't have Onion Knight. So I feel like they just were like, you know, give him a pot that talks and is really friendly. <laughs> and it kind of works, if I'm being entirely honest, because I love him. Ooh. Yeah, he's adorable. He is adorable. So yeah, basically, if I didn't go around there, I could have shortcut it over around here and I would have to gone through that guy. You know? But there is a couple of little secrets along the way. Ooh. Are we ready? Are we ready to fight him? I'm gonna give it a try. Let's give it a shot, huh? This is such an awesome fight, by the way. The cutscenes, the phase two is like one of my favorite phases of a boss. Because they talk about grafting a lot. Mighty and this dragon. is the dude that grafts. Because he's Not got a bunch a of arms. Born heir. Lend me thy strength, O kindred. Deliver me unto greater heights. Look at all those gross fingers. It's horrific. Well. Oh, but his axe is awesome. Yeah, look at all his hands. It's so gross. Plain as a lord. <laughs> I command thee. I shall not need. I am the lord of all that is golden. Uh, he's gross. He's real gross, and he's difficult. So if you're not prepared, he's gonna slap you. But we're prepared. Oh, I forgot about the second. He always does the second. Ooh. Ooh, the tornado. The delayed. I'm still alive. Ooh. Oh, the music is so awesome. Ooh, he got me. I deserved it. <laughs> He's thinking about it. All right, I need to be less timid with him and just go in with it. Wondrous, is it? Let's dance, baby. Let's dance, Godric. Delay. 
Oh, he's doing it. This is early. Oh, I'm, I didn't do the thing I wanted to do. Ooh. Come on. Oh, there's Big Weed Rock. Nice. Oh. 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 Yeah, if you lie on the ground for a second, it doesn't allow him to hit you again, which is very nice. I know you're going to jump. There we go. I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. There you go, buddy. Ooh, cut the boot off the last second. Love that. Oh, this cutscene is awesome. <laughs> it's so nasty, the arm. So remember how we said they were grafted? So he can just attach stuff to him. And becomes alive. Please don't lend him your strength, Dragon. I would really appreciate it if you didn't. It's so cool to see just like corruption that these like deities went through where this dude is just like willing to do whatever. He'll put anything on his body. Noise. <laughs> dude, the voice actors in this game give a hundred and ten percent. So if you can, you can sneak in and do a ton of damage to him on that first one because he just sits there. Woo! I need to stop being so risky. Heal. Woo! He's going buck wild. There's a big bleed proc. Can I get him? Okay, don't be risky. Ooh, heal. Okay, he's running. Gotcha. Ooh, Godric. Second time's the charm, then by. We take it to you, Godric the Grafted. We return together to our home. Bathed in rays of gold. See you later, buddy. Great runes. The great runes you received by defeating shat or shard bearers have lost their beneficial power. However, their power can be restored at divine towers throughout the lands between. See the description of each great rune to discover which divine tower you should visit. Godrix is really not bad, by the way. Just gives you pluses to your stats. And remembrance of the grafted and 20,000 delicious ones. Ooh, 20,000 is so nice. Uh, and when you, if you beat Godric and you didn't kill that dude at the front, he's right there, which is really nice. Um, like, literally, right over there, and he's kicking him, and it's hilarious. Um, but yeah, I am going to leave this episode here, because now we're into the meat and potatoes of the game. We've gotten through this whole area. As you can see, I did a little exploring. You know, I went to Kaelid, I did some stuff. I did some stuff off, off camera, don't worry. Um, but now, once we get these swords leveled up we're gonna be doing some serious stuff so i will see you guys in the next episode see ya and thanks for coming along with me this has been really fun so drop me a like and subscribe and i'll see you later peace we're getting up to mischief